We've retrieved the core memory. It should reveal the location of their homeworld, right? That's right, Fox. Indeed, the time to face the Aperoid Queen has come. Uh huh. The source of all Aperoid will, the Queen herself, makes her vile nest on their home planet. As long as the Queen exists, the Aperoids will continue to multiply. Understood. We're on our way. Fox. Hmm? I'm sensing a distress call from Planet Saria. Saria? From Tricky? I'm not sure. But I sense cries of agony. Fox! Look at that! It's horrible! What have they done to Saria's dinosaurs? This is unforgivable. Aperoid hatchers. This must be how they multiply. If we can destroy those hatchers, we might just have a chance. Okay, let's move. Crystal and I will head down to the surface. Falco and Slippy, the skies are yours. A mission together at last. Oh, uh, yeah. What are you two doing? Let's go! shows enemy strength in the skies of Soria. Watch the gauge and go to the skies when necessary. Falco! Slippy! The airborne enemies are all yours. Gotcha. Try not to make a mess of things, Slippy. Give it a rest, Falco. Seriously. Shut your beak for once. We will save Sauria. You just watch and see. Confirmed. Well done, Fox. Three more hatchers to hit.
I got one on my tail! Sound. Look at the radar, Peppy. Not many Aperoids left. They've begun to retreat. Looks like almost all the Aperoids have been wiped out. Sauria should be safe for a long time to come. Fox! Tricky! Fox! Crystal! I knew you'd come! Thank you so much! Tricky! So heavy! Ouch! <laughs> so, Fox, you're here to fight him, right? Well, I'm going with you! Uh, I appreciate it, but you're needed here, old pal. Besides, I'm leaving Sari in your care. Remember, you're the leader here now, Tricky. Okay. Hmm. I'll do it. Yeah, yeah. I'll take care of things here so you two can come back on your honeymoon. What? What are you, nuts? We aren't... We're not yet. Uh... Not yet? Uh... I mean... I mean... This isn't a conversation for children. You said you weren't gonna treat me like a kid anymore. Then stop acting like one. You're just mad because you don't want to talk about it. All right. That's enough, boys. <laughs>